Oh, it's the morning now. It was the night time before. Oh, that's good. Coughs are not fun. They're not... They're just annoying more than anything else. Is there anything in here I can grab? What's in this one? No, it's this one I want to go to. Okay. We can put the driver in front of a judge in less than a week. Cool. You'd be making a big mistake. Oh dear. Run by me again? He was stabbed with a huge the knife. was dead before the car hit him. Two puncture wounds to the right side of the thorax. Second puncture reached his heart. <laughs> Here's that knife we found. You're kidding me. Been doing this job 23 years, son. No one's ever laughed at one of my jokes. <laughs> stabbed to death? Long shot. I laugh knife, at that. Length of a bayonet. We found a knife in the alleyway. Where is it now? Was it bagged? By Patrolman Kaplan. Perfect. I'll get you a definite match. Jesus, we got him. Murder one. We were right there and they tried to stare us down. Now they'll both get the gas chamber. Oh dear. We have the knife, we have the coroner's report, and I bet we could roll Sabo as a witness. Let's bring her in. I don't know, if I'm honest. I want to talk to the other guy. I would like to talk to the other person, the other location we got given the Shelton residence. I just want to make sure of his story. You can drive. I've been okay actually. Um, it's been a long week. But I'm glad it's over. I'm glad it's Friday. I'm glad it's Saturday tomorrow. And yeah. Yeah. Just winding down with a bit of relaxing driving, gunplay, and other stuff. And where are you going? That's not suspicious at all. Yeah, we need to get this guy. That's the son of a bitch right there. Oi. William Shelton? Yes. It doesn't look good, Shelton. He's gonna You're throw the case. Bags and making a run for it. You know why we're here. Yes. The accident. We've got witnesses who can put this car at the scene. Not to make <laughs> yeah. physical damage. This is open and shut, Shelton. Yep, told you. Howard thinks he can run from everything. Oh, get back here. Come back here, sir. Enough games, Phelps. Take this guy out. I can't get to him. Come back here. I wonder he killed someone driving like this. Uh, oh boy. That's not going well. Don't let that asshole get away. Sorry. Come on, come back here. Come back here, you. I've got not much of a car left. He's heading into the station. Go on, get after him. We have the knife, we have the coroner's report. Hold and it I bet right we there, could roll Sheldon. Sapo as a witness. Let's bring her in. I can't put one on him from here. There we go. Alright, how does a vehicular manslaughter rap sound, Sheldon? <laughs> I hit him 
I admit it. I just panicked, but it wasn't my fault. Why'd you what run? What do you mean? The guy jumped right out in front of me. He came out of nowhere. There's nothing I could do about it. Why didn't you stop? I've had accidents before. Oh, dear. That's it. We're done here. The DA is going to love you. They weren't all my fault. I'm a surveyor. I need my license for my job. There were people around. A woman and a man were standing right next to him. I thought they could get him to a hospital. I'm telling well, you, didn't. it's not my fault. The guy is dead, Shelton. You can't be serious. Hmm. William Shelton, you're coming downtown. We need to talk about a manslaughter charge. No, we don't. I want to get the other guy. So, initial report came back with an ID on our victim. Lester D. Pattison of 182 North Oak Street. Captain wants us there double quick. Yep, let's go there. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, yeah, this officer needs help. 333 oh, South Main Street. 333 South Main Sorry. Street. Officer needs help. 211, the shots fired. Unit to handle code 3, identify. On my way. Then we should go back and get that woman. Stop driving into me! Excuse me. We. Oh boy. There we go, that's where we want to go. Car 11K, we'll handle the help call. 11K, your help call is a global... It's there. <laughs> What's the situation? Uh, we got a hold up gone sour. Three guns locked themselves in with two hostages. I tried to go on through the front, but the place is a fortress. I nearly got a mouthful of lead from my trouble. Oh. All right. I'll see if I can get it through the back. All right, oh, I'll stay here and keep them busy. Let's go. Right back. Oh, I get it. This is the one I didn't do last time. Is that guy dead? Stay in cover! Oh, he shot my helmet. Come on, you. No, let him poke his head out. Stay down! Quick, up the stairs! Get after him! Right up this way then. Nope, he's gone up the stairs. Put the weapon down now. You fucking ask for it. Oh boy. Nope. Nah. That didn't go well. I missed. That's not what we wanted. I think that took me a couple of tries last time. Let's try that again. What's the situation? Uh, we got a hold up gone sour. Three guns locked themselves in with two hostages. I tried to go on through the front, but the place is a fortress. I nearly got a mouthful of lead from my trouble. All right. I'll see if I can get in through the back. All right, I'll stay here and keep them busy. Let's try it again. Let's go. Try the back.
Reinforcements are on the way. Cease and desist. Come on, head. <laughs> Sorry, Bukowski. Quick up the stairs, get after him. On my way. <sighs> I need to headshot this guy. Put the weapon down now. Got him. Yay! Success! Car 11K, I've been involved in a shooting at 333 South Main Street, Globe Loan and Jewelry. It's code 4 now, but the suspect is down. I need an ambulance here. I notify my supervisor and the coroner. <laughs> Car 11K. Alright, back to the Patterson residence. Where are we going to? Where am I more to the point? Where am I? I'm there. So straight up this road. And I think it's the next turning on the right. Oh, turning after that. But it's near enough. Got it there without doing anything, hitting anything. That's good. This way. Ah, I spoke too soon. Try making it to the next intersection without killing anybody. <laughs> Can you do that for me? I'll try. Right. Let's try this again. Answers now. You spoken to the coroner, Mrs. Patterson. He confirmed your husband's cause of death. We'd like you to come downtown and answer some questions. Yeah. It wasn't me. It was Leroy's idea. Leroy stabbed him. I had nothing to do with it. Where is Leroy now? He's in the bedroom. You're no, he's very not. Very good, Lorna. Put the gun down. Leroy, if you do something stupid now, you don't stand a chance in front of the grand jury. Nice of you to give me up, sweetheart. Oh, dear. All that whispering in my ear, telling me how we had to get rid of him, how good it could be, all the money we could claim, all that planning, how to get him into the street, how to make it look like an accident. For God's sake, you Leroy, all shut the up. You had covered, baby. I have nothing to do you with think it. I'm going to fry for you, He's Lorna? He's a crazy man. Shoot him. Shoot him, for God's sake. Oh. It's too late, Sabo. Yeah, not close enough. Ah, uh, not good. Sabo, stop or I will shoot. Get onto the street, might be able to do it. Where is he? Please come back.
Are we going to make a bargain or oh, what? Oh, dear. How long do you think you can hold out? <laughs> Fucking ass for it. Oh, no. That didn't go well. I wonder if I can kneecap him. We spoke to the coroner, oh, Mr. Patterson. He confirmed your husband's cause of death. We'd like you to come downtown and answer some questions. It wasn't me. It was Leroy's idea. Leroy stabbed him. I had nothing to do with it. Where is Leroy now? He's in the bedroom. You're very good, Lorna. Put the gun down, Leroy. Hmm. If you do something stupid now, you don't stand a chance in front of the grand nice jury. Nice of you to give me up, sweetheart. All that whispering in my ear telling me how we had to get rid of him, how good it could be, all the money we could claim, all that planning, how to get him into the street, how to make it look like an accident. For God's sake, you Leroy, all shut the up. Bases covered, <laughs> baby. I have nothing to do you with You think it. I'm going to fry for you, He's Lorna? He's a crazy man. Shoot him. Shoot him for God's sake! Bam. Right, let's try that again. It's too late, Sabo. No, he's gone that way. Sabo, stop or I will shoot! Oh, boy. Last chance to surrender, Sabo. Ah, oh, he's gone that way. I'm just gonna shoot him down, I think. I wanna try and kneecap him, actually. You stay back! I'll ice this one, I don't care. Put the weapon down, now. Hmm. Oh. That's not the right one to shoot. <laughs> I'm trying to... Yeah, do that. Perhaps I need to be right up close to him. We've spoken to the coroner, Mrs. Patterson. He confirmed your husband's cause of death. We'd like you to come downtown and answer some questions. <laughs> It wasn't me. It was Leroy's idea. Leroy stabbed him. I had nothing to do with it. Where is Leroy now? He's in the bedroom. You're very good, Lorna. Put the gun down, yeah. Leroy. If you do something stupid now, I can't do this. I'm now, just going to shoot him. Don't stand a chance in front of the grand nice jury. Nice of you to give me up, sweetheart. All that whispering in my ear, telling me how we had to get rid of him, how good it could be, all the money we yeah, could claim, yeah, yeah. all that planning. How to get him into the street? How Pardon to make me. it look like an accident? For God's sake, you had Leroy, all shut the up! Bases covered, baby. I have nothing to do. You with think it. I'm gonna fry for you, He's Lorna? He's a crazy man. Shoot him! Shoot him! For God's sake! Oops. It's too late, Sabo. Oops! You went out of the way of that. Sabo, stop, or I will shoot. Uh, so we're gonna have to do this the old-fashioned way. I'm trying to get to him before he does. Last chance silly. to surrender, Sabo. Oh well, we're gonna do it the old-fashioned way, I think. You stay back! I'll ice this one, I don't care. How long do you think you can hold out? Hmm. Have it your Got him just in time. So as I said that, the evil, the illusions 
You look spooked, Phelps. I thought you'd been under fire before. It never gets any easier, Bukowski. Hmm. Just got him in time. Back to raise. Oh, it's the police captain. So, I give you a hit and run. You bring me back fraud, conspiracy, and first degree murder. Yep. This is how a good detective operates, Phelps. You take nothing at face value. You keep digging and asking questions until you get to the truth. You got some sharp elbows on you, detective. I like mm -hmm. that. Keep up the good work. Another flashback, or are we into? Nice, very nice. 